Hello everyone! Today we are going to be making super masks. For today's activity, you're going to want a sheet of paper. It does not matter what color or kind of paper that you use. You're also going to want a pencil or something that you can write with. And you're also going to want your scissors today. All right, so to make our mask, we are going to be making a shape that if we turn it sideways, kind of looks like the letter B. So here is how we are going to make that shape. I'm going to take my piece of paper and mine is going to be going the up and down way or the super tall way. And I'm going to be practicing with my finger first before I start to draw. So I am gonna take my pointiest of pointy fingers, I'm gonna start on the edge of my paper and I'm going to be drawing a line. And it's going to go all the way across the paper, all the way off the other edge. I'm gonna practice this with my finger first so that when I draw this with pencil, I remember the direction that I'm going in. So now I'm gonna take my pencil. This time I'm gonna draw with my pencil the entire way across all the way off the edge. Okay, now we have to make this shape here that kind of looks like glasses, or it kind of looks like a super wide letter W. So I'm gonna make this shape next. And I'm gonna do something with my pointy pointy finger again. I am going to find the middle of my paper and I'm gonna make a dot. Not a big dot, just a little dot. Just big enough for me to see it. Now, before I make that huge letter W shape, I'm going to trace a W on my paper with my finger. Now, this is not going to be a pointy W, it's going to be a rounded W. So I'm going to start here on the edge where my line is. I'm going to go down, make a letter U, make a letter U, and end at the dot. I'm going to do the same thing over here. I'm going to start on the edge. I'm going to trace with my finger first so that I'm used to this shape that I'm going to make. And I'm going to make a letter U that starts on the edge and goes to the dot. All right, now this is where we're gonna have to be a little bit brave, superheroes. So we are going to be now using our pencil. We're gonna do this for real this time. We're gonna start on the edge. We're gonna make a huge, giant letter U. You might have to move your hand a couple times because it's really big. And we're gonna do the same thing on the other side. You can do it, everyone. I believe in you, be brave. Okay, there we go. Now we have our huge letter W. If your W doesn't look quite right and you used a pencil, remember you can always erase mistakes if you have any and you can try again. Or you can always flip your paper over and try again on the back. All right, now this is the part where our scissor comes in. We are going to go ahead and cut out the shape of our mask. Go slow and careful and follow your line. Remember that while you cut, you can turn the paper with this hand while this hand holding the scissor gets to chomp. So while this hand chomps, this hand can move the paper. All right, I'm gonna come from another direction. And I'm gonna finish the rest of the way. Okay, now once we are done cutting it out, you'll have something that looks like the letter B for brave. So good job everyone getting this far. The next thing we're going to add 
if we turn it this way so it looks like glasses again, we're going to be adding the eyes. So I'm going to draw two sideways ovals. So we know this shape. It's okay if it's not perfect, just try your best. So you're gonna make two large sideways ovals. Now it really looks like the letter B. <clears throat> so here is the next part that might be a little bit tricky for some of you. We are going to poke a hole in this eye and this eye so that we can cut them out. I'm going to hold my paper really close to where I want to poke my hole. I'm gonna take my pencil and I'm going to poke a hole. So I'm gonna poke, 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 poke. I'm gonna wiggle my pencil in here a little bit to make my hole a little bit larger. And now I'm gonna do the same thing over here. I'm gonna hold my paper really close to where I want to poke my hole and I'm going to poke. I almost had to like pull it up a little bit so it was nice and tight so I could poke. I'm gonna wiggle my pencil, make that hole a little bigger. And now that hole is just big enough for me to get my scissor in there. Once your scissor fits in there, <clears throat> you can try this yourself or you can have a grown up help you. You can cut out the shapes for the eyes. All right, let's do this one real quick. So we're gonna get our scissor in that little hole that we made, it's like a little window. All right, now we're gonna cut out this shape. Okay, perfecto. Now the next part is the fun part. You can use any coloring supplies that you want to use. You can use markers. You can use crayons. You can even use your scrap papers and you can even glue shapes to your mask. So if you wanted to give it some ears or if you wanted to give it whiskers or eyelashes or a mustache, anything that you wanted to add to your superhero mask, including your super letter, you can go ahead and do that. So awesome job trying this shape everyone and trying these new skills of drawing our shapes and then cutting them ourselves. So I look forward to seeing your superhero masks and have a wonderful super time.